Eve. Sam, I just wanted to see how you were doing. Oh, TC, I, I didn't know that you were here. Yeah, Sam and I were just talking about Ivy's latest stunt. Telling him that Ethan's his son, then denying it. I mean, why would she lob him a bombshell like that, then act like nothing ever happened? I mean, what is this woman's point? Yeah, what's her point ever? I'm just grateful to Eve for helping me check out Ethan's files at the hospital. What did she do? Nothing. No, don't listen to her. I'd still be going out of my mind wondering if it weren't for your wife. I mean, she read me the file on Ethan's birth. So? So the story that Ivy gave me checks out. Ethan was born premature, so he's not mine. <laughs> Thanks again, Eve. <laughs> That's my girl. She'll do anything for the people she cares about. So how you feeling now? Well, I mean, you'd think I'd be a huge weight off my back, but, uh, but I don't. I mean, I can't help thinking what it would have been like to have Ethan as a son. Ladies. Go. Oh, it's packed in there, but they said it wouldn't be too long. Oh, that's all right. You know, this is exactly what I was in the mood for. Quiet evening out with our best friends. <laughs> Not a crane in sight. <laughs> Hallelujah. <sighs> Hate to bust a bubble there, partner. You're kidding. Well, well, well. <laughs> we must all be on the same lobster shack schedule. I believe you were all here the last time Julian and I stopped in. No, we were. This is perfect. We can all eat together. Sounds like fun. 